something. I want to read verse six and seven. Ecclesiastes three said, it's a time to gain and a time to lose, a time to keep and a time to throw away. At that time, it was time for my mother to throw that garage door away. She could have kept the new parts, but she needed to get a new door. It was time to throw it away. Verse seven says, a time to tear and a time to sow, a time to keep silence and a time to speak. We have to know when to keep silent when we're about to talk against the promise of God. Let my tongue cleave to the roof of my mouth and then know when to speak life into something. This is about gains and losses to tear and sow. To tear down something, we can tear down something with our words and we can also sow something with our words. John 8 and 32, we know what that is, right? John 8 and 32, and it says, the truth shall make you free. And you shall know the truth and the truth shall make you free. Who's the truth? Jesus, the salvation of God. He said, I will show you my salvation. It's Jesus, it's Jesus. Because in the Christian walk, it says what? And be continually renewed in the spirit of your mind, having a fresh, untarnished mental and spiritual attitude and put on the new self, the regenerated, the renewed nature created in God's image, God life. We gotta look like Christ in the righteousness and holiness of truth. Living in a way that expresses to God, that expresses to God your gratitude for salvation. Your gratitude for Jesus is our salvation. It literally means, his name literally means salvation.